Good afternoon, Keller Williams, and welcome back to the Command 66 Day Challenge 2.0, Day 45. So today we have a new tool that we can use within the designs section of KW Command that's going to make creating your graphics that much simpler and easier, especially when it comes to delivering market snap stats. Excuse me. Let's click on designs here on the left hand side. And we're going to create a new asset by clicking on the plus sign and then choosing, let's say we want to do print. I was thinking about this as a real use case scenario for my own business. And I'd like to do some door hangers in my neighborhood, kind of drumming up business and looking for listings um, there. So I'm going to click on print, create template. I'm not actually going to choose a listing because this is going to be based upon specific neighborhood data. And let's say I wanted to do home valuation door hangers. So if I choose use this template, so I've clicked on home value, I've made sure door hangers is highlighted, use template. And then when you come in, you're gonna see this is a front and back style template, and I can edit one or both sides. So down here at the bottom, you can see we've got page one and page two. So if we look at page one, it's got a nice pretty picture up there, it basically says, whoops, let's get rid of this, here we go. Thinking of selling, I'll help you review your home's value so you get the biggest return on your investment. I like that just as it is. I'm okay with the door hanger you know, cutout being done here. So if we look at the second page, I can edit this, lean on my tracker, get in touch today, and I can put some of my information here. Now here is agent name with brief bio, three to four sentences. What I thought would be really interesting is to use the tool that we now have in here to add the market statistics for my neighborhood. So if I come over here and click on KWLS, I can now choose a snapshots. It used to be just your listing. Now I can choose snapshots and I'm going to search for my neighborhood, which is Fawn Lake, Pine Lakes. And it's going to do a search. It's going to show me here it is Fawn Lake, Pine Lakes. It's going to pull up my neighborhood. And now if I click on this, I can add an image to this document that now has all of the data that's happening within our neighborhood. So it's gonna show me how many active listings there are, how many pending listings there are, how many, what the price per square foot. Let's zoom in a little bit and see. I'll show you that so we can get in there and kind of see it a little bit better. So total active, total pending, average days on market, average list price, per price per square foot. And then we're working with our MLS to release the sold data, but it's still a good snapshot. And what I'd probably do at the top here is put um, Fawn Lake Pine Lake inventory is down to two homes left on the market, period. Are you interested in selling yours today? Question mark, something along those lines. So it's just an easy way for me to include market data without having to go through my MLS and pull up all the information, uh, make it pretty, somehow get it involved. I can simply click on KWLS here on the left hand side and then click on snapshots, put in my neighborhood and this will pull up. And you can do this within all of the designs assets. So any of the templates, whether it's social media, whether it's an email, whether it's print, whether you're doing something on, um, you know, whatever, Facebook, etc., you can utilize this snapshot to pull that data in simply and easily and it makes it look clean and uh, is a great asset to utilize, like I said, just for my example, and door knocking my neighborhood to provide statistics about what's happening in my actual neighborhood. So that's today's challenge. Uh, get into Designs, formerly leading, uh, excuse me, formerly Sketch House, right now called Designs. I wanna get into Designs and play with the snapshot asset icon here underneath KWLS. Um, play with it in a different couple of ways. Create some print assets, create some social media assets, and see how you like it and where you think it fits in well. Guys, I hope you're all having a fantastic day. Halfway point of Mega Camp, one more day left, and uh, exciting afternoon plan for today as well. Hope you guys are following along on the live streams and watching all the amazing content that's coming out. And I uh, can't wait to see where we go from here. So everyone have a safe and enjoyable afternoon. And as always, I look forward to speaking with you in the morning.